This is about your life, your business, your legacy. This pandemic has shown everyone in the world that we have got to find our way to being relevant at all times, no matter what condition your country is in, the, the entire world, no matter what condition the world is in, you have got to find your way to being relevant. You have got to find your way to providing something of relevance internationally. Because as you can see, you're the only one who's going to be able to rescue yourself. You all know that I am Aurora Day, and this is the Secured Entrepreneur Movement. Good morning, good morning, good morning. You already know that it is early around here and I'm gonna answer some of these questions for you all today. I don't know which day, which video is gonna be up, but it's happening, okay? So some of you have emailed about this whole $100 million and Magic Johnson as it relates to small businesses. And thank you for emailing us. Please continue to do so at info at auroradayconsulting.com. Okay, so I really love, 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 love what's going on okay now magic johnson ha is giving 100 million dollars in capital to fund federal loans for minorities and women-owned businesses that have been affected by this pandemic okay now some of you were really uh quite dismayed of the separation between minority and business because normally minority would, would mean women and all of these things. We can't get into that. We can't get into that because the real issue is that your business is undercapitalized and your business is not earning enough income to stay afloat. So now you, you need to at least put forth the effort to apply for whatever type of funding you can get to stay in business. But the statistics have already shown, all right, that the companies who will obtain these loans more than likely will not stay in business because you have an underlying problem, okay? If you have a problem with sales and marketing, Okay, what did I say already? You haven't found a, a way to stay relevant. Okay, can I can Mr. Aurora just tell you that there are some celebrities, there are some people that we consider to be famous who are struggling right now. And I had one of them say, I just realized that I had a job. I said, for real? Like, are we really gonna get into this conversation? He said, Yes, I just realized that I'm only as good as my last job. So I asked him, well, what did you do with the money? He said, I spent the money. That's an honest answer, okay? Because the same question, you know, to a lot of these, you know, and I'm just, I'm reading your emails and you're telling Miss Aurora what in the heaven has been going on. And so when I ask you about, you know, your bookkeeping, most of you are saying you didn't really even keep, you know, records the way that you should have and see these things were pointed out to you when you went to your local bank to try to get funding okay so now let me get back on magic johnson because what's what's what sticks out to me is that this this 100 million dollars is coming from his company his equitrust life insurance company all right how many secured entrepreneurs, entrepreneurs, small business owners, people have a whole life insurance policy that they can tap into like right now, tax free, to help their businesses? This is a major, major issue, okay? So you were asking, where should you be going? Should, you know, Can you go to the bank and request it? Do they know, all right? First of all, it is it is going through the SBA. And I'm gonna show you 
his website. There is a link there telling you where to apply for the funding. This is so doggone juicy right now as I'm looking at it, okay? Because he's saying that many of the companies and the businesses that really needed the money could not get funding. They could not get the, the money that was being uh, uh, lent out and all this stuff because they didn't have real banking relationships. That was the very first thing that I, I read. And they didn't really have real banking relationships. So can we say that they were in business or that they are in business? Like there's a little, okay, help Miss Aurora out here because we're, we're about to get into this. This is Equitrust. Beautiful looking site. Equitrust Life Insurance Company. SBA loans through MBE Capital Partners. Funding provided by Equitrust. Equitrust Life Insurance Company, majority owned by NBA Hall of Fame member Magic Johnson, is providing $100 million in government-backed capital to fund federal loans to minority and women-owned small businesses in response to the COVID-19 pandemic. Equitrust is partnering with MBE Capital Partners, a New Jersey-based non-bank. Who all knows what a non-bank is? Comment down below, let Miss Aurora know. A New Jersey bank, New Jersey-based non-bank lender specializing in business financing for women and minorities. For information, or to apply for a business loan, visit MBE Capital Partners website. Okay, so now they're telling you on their website to go to mbepc.com. So for those of you here in the Secured Entrepreneur Movement who have an interest, okay, in applying for a loan, at this time, please go to that website. All right. For those of you who were saying in the emails that you are done with the SBA, you tried it, didn't work, you have too many complications, you're trying to inquire about this $100 million, and how can you do this? And now you're understanding that it's through the SBA. Okay. I just told you that Equa Trust Life Insurance Company is a non bank. That means that they do not have a banking license. They've got to utilize the SBA. And we already know that, that was, that's going through your local banks or, or FDIC insured banks to provide these loans. Okay. Now let's, let's, let's talk about what Equitrust Life is. It says here, Equitrust is a national carrier of competitive, client-friendly, annuity, and life insurance products available through a national network of independent sales representatives. Magic Johnson Enterprises, comprised of multiple business entities and partnerships, acquired a controlling interest in Equitrust in 2015. Okay, so that's what Equitrust Life Insurance Company is all about, all right? So they, so if you want the money, you've got to go down there and try this whole SBA thing again, go to the local bank, do, do what it is that you must. But right now, Mr. Roar is going to tell you the top two ways to stay relevant, to get back on top because I, I, I'm reading your emails. It's pretty pitiful, okay? Number one, you've got to adapt to some new trends quickly. You gotta do this thing right away, okay? Now, Panera Bread. I tried to get my little quiche thing at Panera Bread. I look on the menu, it's not there. In fact, half the menu is gone. I called, and the young lady said, oh yes. During the pandemic, 
we weren't really selling all those items. So because we do have a, a, a need to stay open and continue to provide service in, this, in, a, in the safest manner possible, we narrow down the menu. So there's only a few things that we're going to make and we will stay open these, these she, she gave me the hours, but she, but she explained to me that they have adapted to the need of people in this time. They have simplified, and that's the second thing. You've got to simplify your approach, adapt to the new trends quickly, and simplify your approach, okay? So the woman was telling me, I can't have a whole staff of people in here making everything on the item, and we already know that there won't be too many people that are going to be willing to come up here, wait, have somebody come to the car, bring them the food. They're not going to order this whole menu. It's not going to be like that. So we have adapted to the trend of making a smaller menu, having less people in here that need to fix these things while still providing excellent service and food, okay? We have simplified the approach because we're staying in business. We're still gonna make money every hour that the doors are open and that we have employees in here who need to be paid, okay? Where is the secured entrepreneur? How are you adapting to the trends as quickly as possible so that you can get back on top and stay on top how are you simplifying the approach of your business? How easy have you made it for your customers and clients and people who are just being introduced to your business to pay you? Comment below, let Miss Aurora know what's going on in your business today. All right, you all know that you can find me, Miss Aurora, at auroradayconsulting.com. And until next time, ta-ta.